For a lot of people, you go to the dentist every six months and you find out, hey, you have more cavities, you have more dental health issues, and as you age, it continues to get worse. But I'm here to tell you that it doesn't have to be that way. In fact, you can be doing things every day that make your teeth stronger, healthier, and also plaque and cavity free. So in this video, we'll discuss the top 10 things that you can do, the top 10 foods you can eat in order to improve your dental health. Hey Wellness Warrior, I'm Dr. Zorowski and the first food we're gonna look at is strawberries. Now we all hear how good vitamin C is for us and we may load up on it a lot in the winter time or when we're sick, but this vitamin is also packed with antioxidants that are needed for growth and repair of the bodily tissue. Strawberries are full of vitamin C, antioxidants, and also malic acid, and all of these help to naturally whiten your teeth. It works like an astringent that can remove surface stains. Now let's talk about leafy greens, because we all know we should eat leafy greens, but we didn't know how good they were for our teeth. If you're not a fan of eating leafy greens, you may wanna rethink your strategy here, because leafy greens like romaine lettuce, spinach, kale, and collards all contain folic acid. That's the B9 vitamin that is also necessary for cell growth and repair. And it reduces, this is important, reduces gum inflammation. It's very often I see individuals with a lot of gum inflammation, which eventually causes recession of the gums as well. So it also makes your teeth much more resilient to bacteria and plaque which is gonna be very important to make sure we fight off. Now, leafy greens provide a barrier against cavity-causing bacteria, including these superfoods in your diet could enhance your dental health in a tremendous way. Let's look at sweet potatoes because everybody loves a good sweet potato, right? I love to take sweet potatoes, put lots of butter on them, and then a little bit of cinnamon is perfect, <laughs> but I digress a little bit. Sweet potatoes contain a lot of vitamin A. This crucial vitamin keeps your mucous membranes and soft gum tissues healthy. It's also critical when it comes to maintaining containing keratin, which is the protein that promotes tooth enamel formation. Now let's talk about something that's kind of obvious, but it's oftentimes overlooked because many people go through life drinking everything but this, and that is water, right? Now when we mention all the foods that you should eat for amazing dental health, we have to include drinking plenty of water too. Your saliva is about 99% water, and it's a critical part of your dental health. Unlike sugary drinks that cause tooth decay, water is healthy and contains minerals and proteins that protect your tooth enamel and prevent gum disease. For added benefit, now this is a bonus tip, for added benefit, you can mix a quarter teaspoon of baking soda in your water. It limits the plaque buildup on your teeth and also reduces the acidity in your mouth. This will help reduce tooth decay and remineralize your tooth enamel. Let's talk about coffee and tea. Well, we're including liquids. Let's not forget about coffee and tea because the good news for us is that not only is a cup of tea or coffee very enjoyable in the morning, but also they contain lots of polyphenols that are natural antioxidants. These chemicals combat cell damage and inflammation. Some dentists recommend tea and coffee to their patients because it can help prevent oral cancers, which is something that is actually continuing to be on the rise. So we wanna make sure we're doing everything that we can there. Now let's talk about nuts and seeds, okay? Nuts have a lot of benefits for your dental health. They contain phosphorus and calcium, which help fight off bacteria that can lead to tooth decay. Calcium is also important for your gums. Some nuts like cashews can stimulate saliva. Other nuts like walnuts contain fiber, magnesium, folic acid, iron, amongst many other vitamins and minerals that are really good for the health of your teeth. Many nuts contain vitamin D, which is also really good for oral health as well. So the thing is too that we wanna consider about eating nuts and seeds is that when you consume roughage and things that are a little bit harder to chew, it actually strengthens your teeth. If you're only consuming soft things, if you're only consuming uh, liquids and smoothies and things of that nature, one of the things you're gonna find is that it starts to weaken the teeth. When you look at a lot of different ancient tribes and tribes that still exist today, they tend to consume a lot of roughage. And so consuming foods that are a little bit harder to chew is good. And that's why I'm a big fan of even chewing gum. And let me say this too, and I have a lot of anecdotal evidence that I've come across on chewing gum and the benefits that it has to your dental health. Now it's not any gum, right? So chewing gum is good to help strengthen the teeth, but also chewing xylitol sweetened gum is amazing. Because one of the things that you'll find is that it will help 
prevent cavities. My children, when they go to the dentist, the dentist will tell them, make sure that you're chewing xylitol gum because it'll help prevent cavities. And the other thing is I have seen, once again, anecdotal evidence. I don't know that there's any research on this, but individuals have cavities, chew xylitol sweetened gum for a period of time, go back to the dentist and find out that the cavity is gone. I've had dentists just totally amazed that they've seen this happen. Um, once again, there's no studies on this, but I've heard many stories and um, known somebody who has had this happen themselves. So this is something that would be very worthwhile to add into your regular routine. It's just chewing xylitol sweetened gum. Now let's talk about some veggies, some crunchy vegetables. Vegetables that require a lot of chewing are great because they clean the teeth surface. Crunchy vegetables are also loaded with minerals that are good for the mouth. Some people even consider celery nature's dental flaws. These foods have tons of nutrients that fight cavities. Veggies like carrots have vitamin C, keratins, and calcium that combine to fight bacteria and keep your teeth healthy. So let's talk about garlic and onion next because this one's important. Once again, kind of back to the bacteria fighting foods that are gonna help you fight off cavities. Now these foods don't particularly freshen your breath. However, the one thing about garlic and onions, they contain something called allicin that has strong antimicrobial properties. The allicin can fight tooth decay and periodontal disease. When you eat raw onions, they have especially powerful antibacterial properties that ward off gum disease and also cavities. So it's big plus. So let's talk about cheese now. Cheese and other dairy products like yogurts are great for healthy teeth. These foods are low in sugar, high in calcium, and dairy products like cheese and yogurt contain casein, which is a protein known to fortify tooth enamel. Calcium also is crucial for maintaining bone density, which you need for strong teeth. So cheese is also high in phosphate, which balance your mouth's pH levels, which will also preserve tooth decay. Now, one of the things that's also very obvious here as we talk about the things you can do to improve your dental health, we want to make sure that we not only eat foods to strengthen our dental health, but we watch out for the foods that are destroying our dental health. And that main one that we have to watch out for is sugar because that sugar feeds that bad bacteria that causes cavities and dental decay. And remember, dental decay is caused by bacteria. So we don't want to be feeding the cavity causing bacteria. And we want to make sure that we're doing everything that we can to prevent this in order to have great dental health. If you enjoyed this video, I'm Dr. Zorowski, and I think you'll like this video next.